two domestically inconsistent sides face off for match day two in Group I of the AFC Champions League as Kawasaki Frontala host Ulsan Hyundai. Frontala opened with a narrow 1-0 win over JDT in Malaysia as Ulsan beat Partham United 3-1. A fiery start to the match as Kawasaki Frontala push forward. A clever flick there towards Yosuke Sagawa, but he hammers his volley off target. And the Japanese continue to press. This is Yasutu Wakizaka, clever bit of skill there, but his effort is well off target in the 10th minute. A brilliant takedown, a clever turn, but in the end, the finish far away from the goal. Ulsan of Korea Republic struggling to get a foothold in the game, but suddenly they might have a chance here. As Lee Dong Kyog takes the shot on from a tight angle, and Jung Sung Ryong saves at the second attempt. Nearly a blunder there against his countrymen. Half time goalless in a very tight match, as Kawasaki Frontala have a free kick opportunity here. There's a bit of a scramble, and eventually it's cleared by Ulsan Hyundai. That just goes to show the lack of clear-cut opportunities in this match. 54th minute, and Martin Adam comes on, having hit a hat-trick against Patam United on match day one. Midway through the second half, still goalless, as Leandro Damiao here He's twisting, he's turning, and his shot is saved by Joe Hyun Woo. Great stop at the near post. One of very few chances in this match with defences on top. 74th minute, Kawasaki Frontala, the more positive of the two sides, as Yasuto Wakizaka takes the shot on, making space for it, but it's straight down the middle. Now legend Bafa Timbi Gomez enters the fray looking to net a late winner. Only seven minutes to go. Coming towards the end of the match now, Kawasaki Frontala really putting the pressure on. As Daya Tono lays it off here. And what a hit that is! The captain Kento Tachi Banada. He's won it late on with a wonder goal. That's a superb angle to see it. He cuts across the ball with the outside of his boot. And it's right into the corner from all of 30 yards. Full time 1-0 to the Japanese as they go three points clear at the top of Group I.